Hello friends, welcome to everybody. In this video, I'm going to discuss about you know, how to prevent duplicate records in Salesforce. Suppose you have a field and you want to make it unique uh, every time <coughs> you enter a new data, like you know either a, some license number, phone number, or any other number which you want to make it unique. So, what are the options do we have? I mean, I'm talking about the easy options. So let's see. So validation rule we look up. Uh, it's very tricky. It doesn't work in most of the cases. I, I mean, I tried recently for one of my requirement and it didn't work. So making a field unique. And what if we have already a duplicate values exist in the application? Do you have some data cleansing activity to do? That's again little overhead. What is the next option? to trigger and apex. I don't think it's worth the effort just to find duplicates and you know show some warning on the screen. So what is the solution? So I would say the matching rules and the duplication rules which Salesforce has introduced recently, it has a quite a lot of options to utilize for you know preventing duplicates and it's point and click. Uh, effort and it doesn't take much effort. So let's go ahead and see how we can do that um, Let's go ahead and see how we can create a matching rules and duplication rules You know to avoid the duplicates. So first let's take this account as an example and Let's make phone number as unique so that you know if this phone number is entered again for some other record it should not allow it to save it or you know show some error but with matching rules and duplication rules i'll show you like what are the other you know many other options available let's go to setup let me create one more window and let's go to setup Sorry about delay. So first let's create matching rules. If you try and uh, if you search in setup, you will get the matching rules and duplicate in rules as well. So new rule you here you select the object and give a name let's say i would say unique phone okay and you can give a description of what choice sorry about that okay unique phone number something okay and here select the phone number and matching method is exact you can select fuzzy if you want but uh, no, let's go with exact and make match the blank fields also no we don't want to match because if there is a two I mean if there is a null value in the phone and you don't want another null value to be added because it doesn't it's not a data null, so that's why we don't want to check that. Let's let me save this. And yeah, here it is account phone exact match. Uh, match blank is false. And let me activate this matching rule. Okay. So now we'll go ahead and create duplicate duplication rules so new rule select an account object and here give the new name I would select the same unique phone number let's change it a bit description if you want to give and here one more option is enforce sharing rules and bypass sharing rules basically what it says is you know if you want to find duplicates for the same user who has created those records suppose i am as a an user has created some hundred records and want to identify duplicates only within that then you 
you know select this and for sharing rules if you bypass sharing rules it will search all across the application so you can find the help test here so and for sharing rule and bypass sharing rules okay and here comes the main part so action on create when you create a new record you want to allow it no i want to block it so it doesn't allow me to create any you know record with those duplication duplicate values so the action on edit i would say allow and alert and let's check report also and see so use one of these records you can give, you can give any of these uh, alert text and matching rules this is a matching rules and select the matching rule which we have created recently which is unique phone and optionally you have few more conditions if you want to now before implementing the duplicates if you want to check any other fields you can select here and give your condition so we don't want to do that right now so let me save this and activate this rule so now as you see you know operation on edit you want to alert and report and operation on create you don't want anything we just block it okay so now let's go ahead and create a new account record with the same phone number let me copy this okay so i have copied the phone number come on let me create a new account with the same phone number which i have copied okay let me give some new rating hot and just i'm selecting some values of it anyway this is just the required field so what i'll do is i'll paste the same phone number which is on which you know, already we have created a matching rule and now let me try to save it here it is the so duplication duplicate detection error has come so this is all this is also showing the record with which it is duplicate with and it says one possible duplicate record use one of these records so it's not giving me any other option to you know uh, save this record so if I save again again I get the same error so I have to change this phone number to any other unique number okay let me save it I have changed the phone number and I have saved it I'm able to save but let's try the update one so now this will be an update one let's try to update the same old number and here is here it is again it shows me this alert save and ignore alert so it's also showing the duplicate record with which it is matching and here it's also allowing me to save this duplicate values ignoring the alert so this is what we have selected in this duplication rule like alert and allow so that's why you know we are able to save this record let me save this we don't get any error and it is saved so that's all about you know how to prevent duplicates you know you can press these features of the salesforce to uh, you know, avoid any duplicates in your object data so thanks for watching bye bye